Hey guys, I'm Steph from RockyTems.com and uh, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a one-page uh, template. Um, this is a new feature of the uh, latest version of the Nimba team. Um, I hope uh, you have the latest version. Um, right now that's 1.7. 1, 1. Okay, so um, let's go to Appearance and uh, click on Menus. Now, um, I already have uh, my uh, one-page menu uh, created. Um, as you can see, it's now assigned as the one-page navigation. Um, I'm just going to delete this menu. Click OK. And uh, let's create a new menu. And let's call it um, one-page menu, click on create menu and now um, we will have to actually create the links that will be used uh, for our one page template. Uh, you won't uh, need any of these uh, features here like the pages you are only, um, we will only um, use these uh, links um, options here so for the URL um, the, first, um, the first item is going to be called home. This will be um, the link that um, when you will click on it, uh, you will be taken uh, to the uh, top of the page. Okay, um, you can call this whatever you want, like um, go home, uh, top, whatever, whatever you want. Uh, one important uh, thing you should remember is that for URL, you need to paste um, the following um, text, like this uh, special. Uh, uh, special uh, character and uh, followed by the um, word home. Okay, this is very important. Click on add to menu. So we have our first um, our first um, item created. Let's go ahead and uh, save the menu. Okay, and also forgot I forgot to assign it um, to our one page uh, navigation. At the moment, we don't have uh, any page uh, that will use this, but uh, we're just going to set it um, as the one page uh, navigation uh, menu. All uh, right. Okay, um, now let's go to pages and click on add uh, new, but let's do this um, in a new tab. I want to keep this uh, menus uh, tab open. Okay, um, let's call this one page navigation example right I'm just going to enable the backend editor this is very important um, click on add a row um, let's go ahead and uh, use the text block element I don't have any content I'm just going uh, just going to um, copy paste this a couple of times because I want to have um, a lot of text Okay, and now before I hit on uh, publish, I want to change the template as well. Uh, so make sure that uh, you select the one page template. This is a new feature, like I said. This is only available from uh, version uh, 1.7 1, 1. of the Nimba team. Okay, click on publish and uh, let's click on view page. Right, so as you can see, we have um, our content here, and uh, now the menu only um, has one item, that's the home element that we created. Uh, as you can see, when I uh, hover the mouse over this um, uh, menu item, in the bottom left uh, corner you will see the actual link, followed by the text that I actually entered in the menu er um, area. Okay. Okay, so now if you scroll a bit uh, down and you click on home, um, actually nothing will happen. You can see that the link here changed. I mean, you have the text that um, we used for our menu here. You can see the URL um, is now part of this URL as soon as we clicked on um, home. Okay, nothing happens. Um, that doesn't mean uh, the theme is broken. I'm just going to delete that and refresh the page. Um, let's go ahead and edit this, this uh, page. Um, and there's uh, another step that we need to take. 
you will have to actually edit this row element. So click on this button here, you can see the message edit this row. And now you see here a, um, a new field called uh, row ID, which is only available for one page template. Now we are using here the one um, page template. So um, in this um, text field, I'm just going to enter home. Um, why home? Because um, that's the name of our um, URL. We don't need to use this uh, sp special uh, character here. Uh, we just need to enter the the text following the the special um, the special uh, character. Okay, so in our case, this is home. I need to copy the exact um, uh, text uh, that you see here. So um, keep in mind that this is uh, case sensitive. So um, home is not uh, equal to this home. Okay, I need to enter the exact um, same text home. Okay, okay. Let's let's click on save and uh, update. Now let's click on view page. And this time, if I'm going to hover, um, sorry, scroll a bit down and click on um, home, I'm going to be taken right up. Okay, so um, this is our first um, item. Let's go ahead um, and try to create uh, more items. So um, again, I'm going to expand these uh, links um, options here. Uh, sorry, in the URL now I'm going to paste, um, I'm going to enter a new uh, text like uh, maybe specials. Um, call this uh, special specials. It doesn't matter what you enter in the link test text. Uh, it's important that you enter here the correct um, um, or um, descriptive wordings if you want. I mean something that you will remember because uh, this URL will be used uh, later on on these uh, row elements. Okay, so let's add the uh, uh, specials. Let's let's try. Um, services, sorry, services, um, call this our services and add the menu. And um, finally, let's uh, add contact and maybe contact us, us, add the menu, save menu, uh, go back to our page, let's, let's click on refresh. Now we have the, the items here, the menu items, but uh, we haven't created any um, sections that we want to link these uh, menus to. So I'm just going to edit this page, right? Uh, now using this uh, clone button here, I'm just going to clone uh, this row, right? So uh, let's make uh, things um, even more clearly. I'm going to click on this uh, plus sign and uh, use uh, this uh, title element. Let's click uh, here and uh, call this um, specials. Okay, it's a very um, easy way to create um, a one-page template. You'll see, uh, right? So now edit the row element, and instead of um, having home here. I'm going to use spatials because uh, this is the name of the second, this is the URL of the second uh, menu item, as you can see here. Remember that you do not have to paste this um, character um, in the um, row ID, only the name of that uh, URL. Okay, so this is spatials. Okay, I'm going to clone this um, again. I will also edit uh, this um, title element and call them. Um, our services are perfect, <laughs> are, are good. Let's, let's not be very hasty about it. Okay, click on save. Again, I'm going to edit uh, this row element and instead of uh, specials, I'm going to use um, services. Click on save. And um, we need another, another um, section here for uh, the contact. Okay, so we have the last uh, menu item should link to the contact uh, section. Clone this uh, row again. Edit um, element. Um, you can contact us here, right? 
save, again edit the row, and this time paste here contact. Remember that contact is the actual URL without the special um, um, character. Okay, click on save, update your page, and click on view page. Right, so now we have uh, a bunch of text here, we have our menu items. Um, so what happens if I'm going to click on specials, you, you ask? Okay, I'm taking to this exact um, uh, section here, our services, and of course, contact us. If I click on home, I'm taken back to the uh, top of the page. Uh, this can be called anything you want. Matter of fact, in fact I'm going to change this from home to um, back to top if I want. Just click on save. Remember that um, you still need to use this uh, special um, text here for the URL. Okay, so home is needed no matter what. Otherwise, you won't be able to go up um, with your menu item. Okay, so um, sorry, I'm going to save this again. Go back, hit refresh. Okay, so this is now called the back to top. I'm going to click on um, our services and back to top. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Of course, uh, this is a very uh, basic example of how to use the one page navigation. Um, you can hide this section here. Um, okay, and of course you can use your own elements. I'm, I'm just using the text uh, block because this is the fastest way to showcase uh, this cool feature uh, we integrated in version 1.7 of the Nimba team. Okay, um, this will be posted on the forum as well, so make sure you watch this um, video tutorial to know how to use this uh, cool feature um, precisely. Okay, see you next time.